Thank you, Paul. And uh, how about this band? Oh, I like that. Yeah. I'm pleased to be here this evening with my uh, wife of 40 years, Karen, over here. Yeah. Uh, we've been, really been treated well in Cleveland a couple of days we've been here. I'm so happy to be here. And I got a lot of friends and family with me here tonight. I'm so happy. Uh, I love music uh, the first time I heard it. Uh, it may have been in a rocking chair when mom was singing gospel songs and nursery rhymes. rock a baby in the treetop. Down will come baby, cradle and all. I think I felt sorry for the little nameless child. <laughs> when I was a toddler, we lived next door to my grandparents, Kenny and Lacey Oldham, my dad, Dewey Dot, his brothers, uh, Gail and Milford, sang harmonies and played a mandolin and guitars. One day, a friend of theirs brought an upright bass. They made music in the living room. I was mesmerized by the sounds they made. And as an eighth grader, my friend Ron Lings and I were walking the hall at uh, Killen Junior High School, and we spotted him an upright piano in an empty room. And I asked him if he ever sang. He said, sometimes. We went to the piano and did a song, popped it on the radio, a whole lot of shaking going on. Uh, Excuse me. Uh, we got through it fairly well. Then started practicing every Thursday night at my cousin Bruce's house. He had a 57 Telecaster. Roger Hawkins played drums. He was 13 years old. We learned some tunes of the day and started playing in high school dances. I've been playing in studio bands and touring bands ever since. And uh, some employers who happen to be friends, I like to thank and I'm grateful for Neil and Peggy Young and Tom Stafford over the city drugstore in Florence, Alabama, where I met many lifelong friends. Rick Hall at Fame Studios and most shows and my bandmates there. Chips Moman at American Studio in Memphis and all the bandmates there. Jerry Works at Atlantic Studio in New York City. And, and that band, and Quinn Ivey and Marlon Green at Norales Studio in Sheffield, Alabama. And, and the list goes on and on, but I've been blessed with uh, songwriter friends like Dan Penn and Donnie Fritz and the late Delaney Bramlett, Don Covey. Uh, I've been blessed with opportunities, and uh, Lord willing, I'll uh, keep getting a uh, chance to make sounds. And thank you all for listening, Lord willing, the sounds will continue. Bless you. Peace. <laughs>